Whoa! Guys, that was amazing. But what's more amazing, guys, is that we finally hit 250,000 subscribers. Now, I have a new challenge for you. Our brand new goal is 500,000 subscribers. So before this video gets started, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and don't forget to click that post notification bell for more videos and live streams. Now I gotta go guys, I'm late for my race, I'll see you in the video! Alright, car dealership tycoon, car dealership tycoon, CDT, and welcome back, it's your boy T-Pro, and today guys, we are here because we just got another leak in car dealership tycoon, and today, I'm gonna be going over it with you because a lot of you guys don't understand what the heck it is, and I'm here to explain it, but before we get started with that, guys, be sure to smash the thumbs up button, subscribe if you guys haven't, and don't forget to click that post notification bell, and also, let me know in the comments down below, how was school? I know a lot of you guys are just now getting off school so uh how was school yeah leave it in the comments down below <laughs> all right guys i'm hopping back into youtube today if you guys haven't noticed i did post a video earlier today about a brand new parrot or piget if you guys missed it i did upload a video about a brand new supercar that joined cdt guys that does not have a wing and yes if you guys like that move that i just did right there smash that thumbs up button right now but let's go ahead and let's talk about what this brand new leak Foxy just posted, guys. It says, I don't know what it's doing or how it's doing that. But it's doing it and it's coming out this weekend. Stay tuned. And you guys can see there is a Fion right there, guys, doing a burnout. And there is a fire emoji and then a tool emoji right beside it, guys. So this could mean only one thing and we are going to be getting upgrades for our vehicle and that can only mean one thing guys that means we're going to be getting an upgrade update this weekend guys in car dealership tycoon so if you guys don't know what this means well let me better explain it to you if you guys look over here on the screen you guys can see that we have these vehicles and you can see that we have this gear right over here so if we click on it you guys can see that we are able to make customizations to our vehicle but now we also have engine and turbo upgrades guys so those are one of the newest upgrades last year so that means we are going to be getting another engine up so a lot of you guys are guessing what kind of upgrades are we going to be getting this weekend are we finally getting nitro update are we finally going to be getting brake update guys that's what's going on is that fire on breaking really hard is that why it's smoking well let me tell you exactly what's happening right there guys so if you guys check out the fire on right over here you guys can clearly see that this is a front wheel drive car and you guys can see in that picture it is not breaking it's actually doing a burnout and it's not doing a burnout from the front wheel guys it's doing it from the real wheel that means guys we are going to be getting a drivetrain update this weekend yes that means we can switch our front wheel drive car now to a rear wheel drive and that gives us a lot of benefits guys and i'll talk about it in just a second but i'm super excited that that actually is the update guys i mean i'm sad that it's not the nitrous i'm kind of sad that they still haven't added up upgrades in here but you never know they might throw that in last minute guys and we might be getting a update trailer coming soon so we got to see what's going on as soon as that update trailer drops guys but as of right now, it looks like we are going to be getting drivetrain changes. You guys can see that car is now doing a burnout in real wheel drive. And that's a lot of benefits, guys, because that means we can actually go to the drift track now and actually drift the Fion. And there are a lot of vehicles in here, guys, I would beat the bleed if it was an all-wheel drive car. So I'm actually very excited to see how that's going to change the game in CDT. So you guys know there is a lot of cars in here that are real-wheel drive, and that's very beneficial when it comes to the track. But if it's changed to all-wheel drive and they're bringing it to the drag race, that is a whole totally different story. Now, this is going to be a big game changer, guys, because you know the fastest car in the game is the Koenigsegg Absolute. And you guys know that this is a rear-wheel drive car. Now, if we switch this to an all-wheel drive car, how is this going to compete against the Bugatti Bolide? We're gonna find that out guys and that's gonna be insane and then after that 
we can actually take the bleed into a rear-wheel drive mode and go drifting with this. So I'm excited to see what we can do with this update, guys. And you know what, guys? The cool thing about this update is that we can actually tell you guys the difference. And you know what? The cool thing about this update, guys, is I can actually educate you guys the difference between what would make on how the drivetrain could make a big difference on these hypercars. Trust me, guys. If you switch this all-wheel drive Bugatti into a front-wheel drive, you will see why they didn't do that. <laughs> Maybe we can make comparison videos of all of the cars in here, guys, with the new drivetrain. I think that would be pretty cool. But I really wish they would have done a whole entire mechanic update or a whole entire upgrade update, guys, where they could have added the nitrous and the brakes with it. I don't know why they're kind of holding up a little bit. Seems like most of the game kind of has brakes already, at least but not nitrous but you know what this update is uh might be a little bit fun guys we could do a little bit of experimenting especially with the bugattis turning into real world drives i mean we have done that to driving empire already but there are some lamborghinis in here that i would kind of want to see in all-wheel drive mode so let's see how this new update can actually change the race and the course of the game guys there's really not much like benefits to like a front wheel drive you know car besides you know efficiency and it being cheaper like this all-wheel drive subaru we can take it to a roller drive and start drifting it which would be absolutely amazing we can do the same thing with the teslas guys and then there are other cars in here that we could probably switch the drivetrains guys and we'll probably see how it's gonna perform i know there's a lot of cars in here that i kind of want to see uh, in real world drive guys like the bugatti pure sport this one right here i kind of want to see in real world and then drift it and then also guys there are some cars in here that i kind of see in all wheel drive mode like for example the apollo ie and uh, the project evo these are my favorite cars and now if they're all wheel drive that could change the game now we also got the top fuel car in here guys that is a real wheel drive now i wonder if we can actually change this to a front wheel drive or an all-wheel drive that would be absolutely insane but other than that guys i know this update is going to be super fun there's going to be a lot of things that we can do with this update guys and who knows maybe we'll go drifting with the school bus if we learn how to do it in a real wheel drive guys but i'm super excited i wonder what else they're going to be coming out with this update guys i know they're going to be coming out with like different cars and stuff like that but we'll probably know tomorrow for the update trailer and also we might get a couple more leaks before this update releases but thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did give this video a big thumbs up subscribe if you guys haven't also i have been trying some rps in my channel guys if you guys have not checked it out go check it out in my channel and if you guys are liking them let me know what kind of rp you guys want me to do on the channel but thank you so much i'll see you guys in the next video and peace out